trolley project. Smart trolley uh, here in shopping malls. Uh, we are going to uh, sh shopping. We are going to do. Uh, we should not wait in the uh, building counter. So whenever you are going to take a product and scan through the QR code. So once uh, QR code uh, printed, then the product count and the price expiry date everything it will be stored in the database. So it will be matched and it will be shown in the LCD. So LCD it will be displayed whatever the product you are going to scan. Okay. So once uh, there is a two buttons here. Here this is for to scan the product. So this is for end of the uh, shopping. Okay. So this camera for used to scan the product. This camera to use the object tracking. See, uh, if suppose whenever we are going for freight, uh, it will be tracked uh, uh, in back side. Okay. So if you move left right, automatically it will be tracked using the image processing algorithm. So this is ultrasonic sensor to use the any uh, some other object is there it will be stop and it will be buzzer will be glow. So here uh, Raspberry Pi 4 we are going to use it. Okay. So here switch for turn off the complete product LCD. So battery for power supply. So then so inside motor driver is there. Okay. So this is for ATC for load cell. So load cell we are going to use for suppose we have scanned some product. So those weight will be those weight will be calculate all the product. Suppose we have a 10 kg of product scanned and also it will be extra item if you put it in this trolley. It will be uh, compare and if it is more than the product scanned any product is available then it will be buzzer will blow and theft is up and it will be displayed. So before that, so I am going to consider these two as a product. So this product 35 gram, 25 gram. So here QR code generation we have some website qrcodegenerator.com. So here database I created like ID, uh, product ID, mobile, price, weight, uh, start date, manufacture date and expiry date so if you enter like this you will get a QR code so just you can download it with the name so we will get a QR code we can paste it in the product so I have done some products uh, I have stored like this is a complete project folder here so database I have created here so product ID, product name, price, weight, manufacture date, expired date. So product ID 1, product ID, 5 products I have added, water bottle, mobile, laptop, LCD, camera, corresponding, price, weights I have added, all the data it is available in the .csv file. So now I will give you real time demo. Just go to main code. You can just run the code. So you can run this code. So once you run this code, the object uh, from the front camera any object is there based on that it will be tracked ok so left right movement it will be come according to the as of now I given red uh, red color object so now forward So if there is no object detected then it will be stopped.
So here forward now, as of now, you can see forward. It is visible, right? So now left. The object is moved left. So now right. It moved object is right. Can see that right. So if you go for center, it will be forward. So this is how the object will be track. So next I will do scanner. So whenever you want to uh, you want to scan the product, we have a switch. Once you turn on the this camera will be turned on. So. So you can do this. So there you can see the pro scanned product and details. Okay, once scan, uh, product is scanned, those product you can keep it here. So again, one more uh, product I'm going to scan. So scan the details also you get it then second product also you have to keep it here so now once scan, uh, product scan is done you can stop this scanner so once scanner is stopped then automatically the object tracking will start okay So it will be object tracking will stop. Whenever you want scan, you can scanner you can turn on. So now I am going to end up the end up the I am going to end up the uh, shopping and this is the button for end up the shopping. Just end up, you will get here total product cost and weight there. you can see here total weight is 59.5 grams it is rated so no buzzer is blown now I am going to again press save button it will end up the process so completed so now I'll just run again for the process. I'm going to scan one product. scanned one product I'm keeping that two product I'm going to carry so you can stop the scanner process then after some time you can just end up the process You get a buzzer for that. So almost uh, more than the weight. Here, show. So the total product cost will be 250, and weight will be 35. But we are getting here weight, actual weight from the trolley, 53. 
so we are uh, the customer is carrying more product that's it